life sucks and I never try to decide me nice Fuck to the more than I realize Times up, keep moving, but see your eyes If you've ever heard what I heard in my mind Never tried, you'll cry, that's a lie, you would die I don't wanna ever come down from a high I am in the best seat from time and the next breed If you come and come and make the wreck, you don't need no one to defend me Souls in a place where I can't get to Don't fuck with the deadly Moon waves and overseas, quick coats and overseas Fuck those who don't believe They will never wanna admit I'm the best here From the mere fact that I've got ovaries It's a woman's world, so to speak Pussy you sour, never giving credit where it's due Cause you don't like pussy in power Then I'm Hey, good morning. Can you dig it? I just woke up, so you gotta excuse my appearance. I apologize, but I'm just sending a message to some folks. You live in Baltimore City, Baltimore County. Let me explain something to you about the state's attorney, newly elected state's attorney, Ivan Bates. I sent Ivan Bates the information about the prisoner abuse three times, I'm sorry, twice before he was elected. And I didn't say anything about him publicly because Marilyn, Marilyn Mosby is such a dirty bitch and such a corrupt bitch that I just assumed that, you know what, let me get her corrupt ass out there and hope that Ivan Bates will be a better candidate. You dig? You know, but I didn't say anything about Mr. Bates because I knew that he was going to step up and, you know, prosecute the criminals since he's the state's attorney. He, you know, he's the, the major cop. You know, the state's police. And I knew he wouldn't. He would. But he just got um, elected. I sent it to his, his office, the prison abuse. And um, he told me that my house being burnt down and my $363,000 worth of checks that were forged is a civil matter. But he didn't say it specifically. He got this clown ass bitch named Corey Holcomb. Whatever the fuck his clown ass name. He's a bitch. He don't like it. He can get with me, but he's a bitch. So check me out. I don't think it's fair that criminals can prosecute people. Let me tell you about your boy, Ivan Bates. I like to, um, now, Mr. Ivan Bates is the state's attorney. I don't think that's fair that he's a state's attorney if he's a fucking crook. So what I'm going to be doing all week is talking some very personal shit about Ivan Bates' crooked ass because Ivan Bates is a fucking crook and I got proof and I got a bunch of names, big names. Ivan Bates made his money off of selling, off of for defending the big dope dealers. I mean, the niggas who carry weight, the big time dope dealers. Let me give you one case in point. Every day I'm gonna come up with a di big, different dope dealer that Ivan Bates conspired with to do some illegal shit. He dirty as fuck. There's a gentleman by the name of Antonio Anthony Davenport. Davenport was a big time drug dealer. Big, he carried a lot of weight. You did, he carried a lot of weight. He's a big time dope dealer. And guess what? One time, Mr. Davenport got caught up by the law. He was facing a whole bunch of time. So he went to Bates, because Bates is the dope dealer. The big weight, he carries all the weights he carries. He's the one who defended all the dope dealers who were trying to get triple life. That's that nigga. So let me tell you what Ivan Bates, the state's attorney, that crooked bitch did when it came to Antonio Anthony Davenport. Anthony Davenport got caught with some weight and was about to spend, they was about to put this nigga under the jail because he'd been doing it for a long time. So his attorney at the time, Ivan Bates, your state's attorney, who y'all made the number one motherfucking prosecutor, the state's attorney, told Tony, hey, Tony, what you need to do is you need to find somebody with a clean record who never been in trouble before and we're going to put it on them and let them take the charge since they've never been in jail before. Because if they put you in jail for this, you're going to go to jail forever. So Ivan Bates directed Tony and his aunt to say that it was his aunt drugs and not Tony drugs. And that she was supposed to get a slap on the wrist. But instead, this law-abiding citizen, mother of a few different children, they put her ass in prison for five fucking years and she didn't do shit. You know why? Ivan motherfucking dirty bitch Bates. Understand. I'ma also listen, I'ma listen. So she he he gave he made her pretend that the drugs was hers because she's had a perfect, squeaky clean record. You dig? So because of the first offense, the whole thing is like, you know, it's the first offense. You're not gonna get no time. So he let her know, hey, you're not gonna get in trouble for this. You sweet law-abiding citizen, but you just take this charge for this one 
Don't get in no trouble because you don't do nothing. You are a lawful citizen. So you're not going to get no time. They gave this mother with no time, with no criminal history five fucking years for her first thing. You dig? And they did that because Ivan Bates told her to do that. And they told Anthony Davenport to do that. He's a fucking crook. You dig? So what I'm saying is, listen, every day... I'm going to come out every day with a, dip, a different kingpin. You don't like pussy in power. Let him. Every fucking day this week. Let me tell you a different story about motherfucking Ivan Bates. He dirty as fuck. You understand? I worked for the princess for 13 motherfucking years. So I know all the dope dealers and the kingpins. You dig? So every story I know about a kingpin that he done did some dirt with because he dirty and gritty as a motherfucker. And I got proof and I'm going to start putting videos and tapes out too. Ivan Bates, uh, Corey, you still a bitch. So dig it. Every fucking day Ivan Bates is going to get a new story about some illegal shit he did. Why the fuck is this criminal state's attorney? You tell me why. I'll tell you what. I'm going to give you another story about some other shit tomorrow. I'm going to talk about a gentleman by the name of Raymond Hall tomorrow and Ivan Bates. You understand? I'm going to tell you about seven other niggas this week that Ivan Bates did some illegal shit with. The problem is you got to start doing shit with niggas and try to keep their mouth shut. You dig? But you know what? He's a goofy looking ass, goofy looking ass nigga. He don't know that these niggas go out there and talk to bitches and bitches talk to everybody. and Everybody knows. So guess what? I'm going to put your dirt out there, Ivan Bates. You shouldn't be states nothing, bitch. And you core in your office. You's a clown ass nigga too. You just a straight bitch, Corey, whatever the fuck your name is. But guess what? You dirty. And everybody gonna know how dirty you are. So we're gonna get ready for your inauguration. Also, I'm gonna send this shit to the feds so they can get your ass. They gonna ham your ass up. The feds gonna see what the fuck you did. State's attorney Ivan Bates. Since you don't know how to prosecute crimes. Let me go ahead and let them know the crimes that you did, state's attorney Ivan Bates. So guess, so tomorrow... Fuck it tonight. Expect another story about Ivan Bates and his dirty, crooked ass. Dig it. Good. You, ain't wanna, you don't want to prosecute criminals? Don't worry about motherfucker. You a criminal. Let's prosecute you, state's attorney. Can you dig it?